three of high school football spring practice underway and we continue 33 teams in 33 days. A month long behind the scenes look at your favorite programs. Tonight we are making our way to Theodore High School. The Bobcats welcoming a new head coach, but someone who is a familiar face to the area as Steve Mask takes over the program. The longtime St. Paul's coach replaces Eric Collier who left for a position at South Alabama. Now Mask walks into a pretty good situation with the Bobcats. The program coming off a region championship and a trip to the 6A semifinals. Theodore beat Sarah Land in the regular season but lost to the eventual champs in the playoffs. Coach Mask tells me he likes what he sees from his team's energy and excitement during spring ball. Tradition at Theodore speaks for itself. You know, the kids here love to play football, so if you love to play football, you like to practice. Uh, sometimes practice is not a lot of fun, but these kids seem to enjoy it, and that's what we're dealing with right now. The kids are kids, and the expectations at Theodore are just as high as they are anywhere else we've been. And uh, you know, I'm having the time of my life, and uh, the kids and I are, are, are getting along really good and getting to know each other, the staff and this. So, you know, I could I couldn't ask for a better situation than what we got right now. So that's the good thing about having spring training. You could do a little bit of experimenting with some players and trying to get the players in the right position. So the biggest thing out of spring is, is to try to find out where we need help and where we need to plug a little bit and go from there. But to really find out where players can play and find the best way to do to help their ability. And here's a look at the top guys returning for the Bobcats this year. The leader on offense, quarterback Cameron Rigby, enters his senior season. Last year, he accounted for 21 touchdowns and more than 1,200 total yards. On defense, Kevin Norwood returns up front. He posted 86 tackles and five sacks last year. And Theodore's do-it-all guy, Cameron Pruitt, plays both ways for the Bobcats. The four-star prospect recorded 99 tackles, 15 for loss. He has offers from Alabama, Auburn, and several SEC schools. The guys tell me they've enjoyed the spark that Coach Mask brings to the program. So far, the first thing I noticed when he came in, he brought a lot of intensity. Uh, he's always jumping around. He brings a lot of energy, which brings a lot of energy to the team. You know, he's not a uh, he's not always screaming at us, but when he needs to, he gets on to us. I, like, I love Coach Mass. Coach Mass, I love Coach Mass. He's a good coach. He keep me straight. He tell me the truth. He keep a hundred me. He don't sugarcoat nothing. Everything is a business, so he keep everything straight order and take care of us and make sure everybody good and healthy. Well, everybody wants the blue map, but right now we're just trying to build the team. Um, everybody's trying to come together, have one goal, one mission. I hope the conference will win the state championship, but we got to put it in grind, effort, and trust the coaches, trust the process. Now Theodore will play Jackson in a spring game at home on Thursday.